Hi, Ken Yachts here with the Barndo Co. I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about the difference of a Barndominium build, um, a standard Barndominium build, a Barndo Co. build, and even a pole barn. So first of all, you can see here, um, we have a monolithic slab. What we do is a single pour, um, just a continuous slab. So this entire footprint um, is poured at one time. So we have a good solid foundation. Also, all of the poles on Barndominiums are um, exterior load bear bearing. There's nothing on the interior that is um, bearing any weight and you can see here we put all of our poles above ground um, so that along with the, uh, the solid foundation that gives you a couple of advantages number one you're going to be in compliance with all national building codes and requirements and that's going to help you tremendously when it comes to lending as well as when you're dealing with insurance companies so um, then we come to the inside another big feature uh, for our builds are what you see up here on the ceiling is steel trusses. Um, most builders, the vast majority of them use wooden trusses. Um, first of all, we, we love uh, just the look of it. Um, it's a nice, clean, modern look, but it also gives you a much higher wind rating, which is gonna make your home a lot safer. And now we're gonna let Daryl talk to you a little bit about the interior. In addition to what Ken gave you uh, with our trusses and to our design on our poles, we have what you have in a pole barn you have the two by eights that are normally attached on the outside of these six by six posts. In our builds, we bring them inside and we put them in between so where we can build interior walls completely encasing the, the unit. What it also allows us to do is we can house electrical and we can put plumbing. Now we can go back and add drywall to this wall and it gives us nailers to be able to put that to encasing this and making it a home. 